Welcome. Today's session is on bridging the gap in talking to instructors. I'm very happy that you've joined us. Of all the teachers you have had in your life, which one do you remember most fondly? If you're lucky, you've got someone in mind, a teacher who encouraged and inspired you and perhaps played a role in shaping the person you are today. Many students seem afraid of talking to professors because for whatever reason, they forgot that their professors are human. They are people too. Sure, they give you grades and bust you for improperly formatting your citations, but they are also people who are trying to do a job the best that they can. The real truth is, most professors often wonder why more students don't take advantage of the opportunity to talk with them. They appreciate students who ask for help. As a student, you are an important part of your instructor's world. Asking questions in class may take a lot of courage at first. Students may fear that they will be wasting their classmates' time or that they will look stupid if they ask what seems to be a simple question. But the only stupid question is the one not asked. Most professors appreciate your courage to ask and will support your efforts to participate in class. If you're uncomfortable asking questions in class, make an effort to see your professor during office hours. Office hours are regular times each week that instructors reserve for meetings with students and they are usually posted on the course syllabus. Please check for this early on in the semester and make a note of it in your planner. If office hours don't work for you, you might have another class or some other schedule conflict during the instructor's office hours. You can ask for an appointment. When you ask for an appointment, offer the instructor some options to choose from. Say something like, I have class during your office hours, but I like to make an appointment to talk about, then mention the topic you need help with. Do you have time on Wednesday or Thursday afternoon? Time may be limited, so think beforehand what the purpose of the visit is and prepare for your time together. Go over your notes on readings and lectures and write down your specific questions. You'll feel more comfortable and the instructor will appreciate your being organized. There will be times when you don't understand the concepts presented in class, the language used in lecture, or the instructions for an assignment. At these times, it's tempting to smile and nod as if you do understand. This is a huge mistake. You can politely ask for clarification in several ways. One, I'm sorry, I'm not sure I understood that. Or, I'm sorry, would you mind explaining the last point one more time? Or third, let me make sure I understand you correctly. You're saying that, and then continue on explaining. Professors know that all students are different. When students articulate what helps them learn best, professors are more effective and the class is a better experience for everyone. Professors have email and office hours for a reason. Don't be hesitant or apologetic for using them. You may be able to grasp the material better during a one-on-one -on -one office hours meeting. There may come a time when you may need to notify your professor about your situation if it is impacting on your academic progress. Don't try to talk about your concern before or after class. Make an appointment with your instructor. Approach the faculty with a cooperative spirit. Explain your situation and then make the request. Most professors will be very accommodating if you ask for help well in advance. When the conversation is over, say thank you and let them know you appreciate their time 
and assistance. Thank you for viewing and hope this helps. We welcome your feedback.